Hello, and welcome to my GM. I am WWE superstar Xavier Woods, but you might also know me as Austin Creed, creator of Up, Up, Down, Down, and the greatest GM of all time. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, no, no, why? Greatest GM of all time? Why are you here? You've never beaten me, which makes me the greatest GM of all time. Get out of my face. Look, everyone, it's Prince Petty. I think you mean Prince Pretty, AKA King of Cuteville, AKA Definition of Delish, AKA Longest Reigning Up, Up, Down, Down, Slash, Left, Right, Left, Right, Champion of All Time, AKA Tyler Breeze. And I'm not gonna be disrespected by the GM of the B Show. Oh, you mean B for better? Yeah, that's me because I know how to truly manage a roster and put my superstars in the best position to keep them, the fans, and the commish happy. Yeah, if you don't run out of money first. Meanwhile, I watch as my fans multiply and the dollars roll in thanks to my careful planning, creating masterpiece matchups with every show I touch. Masterpiece? That's a hilarious way of saying stale. I handle any shakeups that might come along while also having the poise and grace to make the hard decisions. I don't think so. You're gonna be sitting up in the cheap seats while I manage my way right to the Hall of Fame. <laughs> the only way you're getting on that Hall of Fame stage before I do is if you're inducting me. Well, it looks like there's only one way to settle this. Only one. Simulate. Scottish warrior Drew McIntyre has arrived. And a fight is about to start. We have learned that wherever McIntyre goes, brutality follows. Right now, it is McIntyre who is leading the WWE Universe into battle. It's scheduled for one fall, and it's for the WWE Intercontinental Championship! Making his way to the ring from Ayr, Scotland, weighing in at 254 pounds, the Scottish Warrior, Drew McIntyre's has been a journey of redemption, of making up for lost time. Drew has taken titles and main events by force. Listen, he beat Brock Lesnar at WrestleMania to win the WWE Championship. He's had epic clashes with Roman Reigns, and he's stronger than ever. From Pachuca, Kentucky, weighing in at 190 pounds, Ricochet! Well, up to this point, Ricochet has seen plenty of success here in WWE. Won titles with his unbelievable agility. It's like Ricochet found the options menu for life and turned off the gravity option. Yeah, no camera tricks, no hidden wires. Ricochet. He's the real deal.
lay claim to the workhorse title here tonight. Guys, we talk a lot about superstars who love to fight here in WWE, but for my money, Drew McIntyre is right there on the top of the list. Talk about a warrior-like mentality, huh? And they don't call him the Scottish warrior for nothing, Bill. This is a man who refuses to back down from a fight, and he will always keep going with everything that he has. Yeah, and then some. And with Ricochet, you're looking at an absolutely freakish athlete. But I worry about his longevity. Can Ricochet maintain a high level with the wrestling style that he brings to the table? I see no cause for concern at all, Corey. What would be risky for others is second nature to Ricochet. His style should get him very far tonight and in the future. Foot to the gut. Hard ride to the outside. He's taking this to the floor now. An agile escape. And another counter. And this might not have a pleasant ending. Look at this. And that was taking the attack to the competition with that one. And he gets delivered back into the ring. Oh, what a close line. Superhuman confidence from Ricochet as he reaches towards perfection. That high-risk style of Ricochet got a bit grounded there. Yeah, as McIntyre was putting that warrior spirit into effect with that. Must have forgot what kind of match was going on for a moment. Whip back into the ring. The intensity of Drew McIntyre. Saving us from having to sit through that. He's taking a moment to feel the crowd, but he better focus on the opposition. And that was an efficient display of offense with that maneuver. Taking a trip outside, but he's got to be mindful of the count. Boom! Beautiful. Thrown yeah. out of ringside and back to the mat. Check out the springboard. Close line. That was amazing. McIntyre gets away from that. From Drew McIntyre. Mac oh, there it's time for the countdown. McIntyre hits the floor. Ricochet fell that one big time for the win. There's two. Somehow he kicked out. They don't call him a superhero for nothing. How else do you explain that kick out for Ricochet? The man is not you from the top. Crash landing. Able to avoid there. Going right after the neck, neck breaker. The damage he's taking is starting to pile up. Oh, elbow to the face. Uh-oh. Punch to the stomach and stopped in their tracks. And there was some force on that move. He takes control. Firm control. Big boot. Continuing to work on the arm with a vicious knee drop. A strong impact from Ricochet. As the leg trap, Fisherman suplex. Boom, right across the small of the back. is just unloading now. Just relentless attacks from Ricochet. And that was an effective attack, guys. He steps foot in the ring again. Oh, there's the Pele kick. And that 
McIntyre on the receiving end of some stiff offense there. Ricochet making it look easy. And now his confidence has got to be blown. Walked right into it. Pin attempt for the championship. One, two, oh, he got the shoulder up. How in the world? Oh, strong knee connects. McIntyre must be getting phased by this attack. Drew doesn't usually allow his opponents to gain this much confidence. Check out the springboard. Close line. That was amazing. This could be big. Going up high. Top rope. Oh, misses the mark. Two more connects. And guys, now I see blood on the face of Ricochet. And a kick out. No one saw that coming. What in the... Where did Ricochet find the strength to kick out of that? Now, at this point, I think it's more instinct and adrenaline than anything else. And where McIntyre goes from here is unknown. Drew is accustomed to putting out so many men with that maneuver. Lucifix has scissors. Oh, man, right to the arm. Hyper extends your elbow. Knees up. Saw it coming and was laying in wait. Boom. He's not going to be able to pull this off, is he? Oh, is he? Yeah! Wow! The close of this match is just ahead. Yeah, this is a dire situation right now. And he gets set back into the ring. He's going for it all. From the top! Now a pin for the championship! match we are witnessing. Oh, ricochet. Ricochet with the recoil. Shoulders down. Championship on the line. Shoulders down. One, two. I can't believe the ref didn't even get to one. And somehow this is not over. Ricochet cannot believe that didn't end this. Suplex. to say one of the most exciting superstars in all of WWE. And here's the example of why. Oh, and a kick up with a drop kick. With a championship on the line. Kick it out in time. So, so close. That could have been it. Ricochet heads up, thinking high risk. Uh-uh. No way. Shooting star. Ricochet, beautiful. Sights set on the top rope. Ricochet ready to strike. Oh, 630 finds the mark. McIntyre's in dire straits. Yes, got it. New champion. Here's your winner. And new WWE Intercontinental Champion.
Day has arrived. to success. He's main event at some of the biggest events in NXT history. And Johnny's well equipped to continue that upward trajectory on the main roster. Scratch and claw through the independence through NXT. Now the spotlight is on Johnny Wrestling. And he will not give up that spotlight to anyone. Tag 
Team Championships on the line in this chaotic tornado tag match with Seth Rollins and Karrion Cross. And in the other corner, they will be dealing with Johnny Gargano and Cody Rhodes. All the way slam with poof. Hooked up. A small package driver. Stretching and tearing at all the ligaments in the leg. Spiked. Top rope, here we go. Here we go. He gets back into the ring. And Gargano with ring awareness. Ooh. Oh, club with a right forearm. That was a hell of a maneuver there, guys. Rollins escaping danger. Oh my goodness, they're striking at will. He's taking some good hits. Driven into the barricade. Fighting back with a counter. Stop to the chest. Johnny wrestling, rallying the fans behind him. throwing all caution to the wind. Spitting in the face of danger. What a throw. A oh, jumping knee strike. Lights out. Uh-oh, double underhook. This is going to be nasty. And Rollins, shoulders down. Championship on the line. He keeps his team in the match. Oh, just gouging the face. That's not right. Oh, there's the old stump puller leg snap. Very perched up top. And back in the ring we go. And targeting the leg there. He's struggling a bit here. Oh, this is just too far. Get some control in there. And that was a well-executed attack. Uh-oh. Nothing fancy there. No telling what's underneath the ring tonight. Oh, no. Now that he has the kendo stick, I definitely do not want to be in his path of destruction. Look at this. Just unloading. Oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. Timing with that reversal. And look at from. And he heads out of the ring. No count outs, no worries. Right to the kidneys from behind. And a well executed move we just saw there. A uh, jumping stop to the gut. He returns to the ring. And he'll leave the ring for this next stretch. Ross trying to get into his opponent's head. Perfect drop kick off the barricade. Drop kick finds the spot. Jarring impact. Time may be up for cross. Giant Rising with a takedown. We're going to sink it in. There it is. The escape. Gargano escape is locked in. This has got to be over, Gargano. He is in serious trouble here and finds his way out. Oh, and that one busted up Johnny. Taking this one back to the ring now. Oh, and and destroyed. And Cody didn't see that coming. Oh, he knew what was coming. Delivers the knee. There he goes, right into the corner.
Will there be an escape for Gargan? There's the save. How close was that? Oh, look at that. World's about to head to the pain. See a kick out there. He keeps his team in the match. Hoist it up. Oh, blow to the bread basket. Getting set up for something in the corner. Cody retaliates. What a punch. Uh oh, Ooh, just turn that around. Ooh, hello. It's always disorienting taking those hits above the shoulders. To a perfect drop kick. Seth Rollins up the turnbuckles. He'll take things in from the top. And we see him take yet another shot to the body. Snapmare takedown. Oh my, single leg drop kick. with a hurtful purpose. DDT! And he's already taken more hits up there than he should have to handle. And Cody's resolve might be wavering here. And Rollins is on a roll, gentlemen. Look at this, just went a barrage of stops. And that was a well-targeted attack. Fisherman's Buster! Re-entering the ring now. Rhodes showing his opponent how confident he is. Now a pen for the championship. Oh, a kick out. This is amazing. He got whipped into that corner. Rollins now from the middle row right into the Set him up. Russian leg sweep. Oh. Ooh. From way up. He paid for that one. Oh, man. Big time. Oh, that hurt right to the kidney. Golly. And he goes into the ring. Knee strike. Continues to focus on that region of the body. Shirley is pinpointing that spot. Carefully placed stomp to the arm. Rollins, kick to the gut. Arms hooked. Battle Take it down. Here's the pin to the line. There we go. With a championship on the line. I thought for sure he was done.
Hitler is basically a five-star general of psychological warfare. Learned his killer instinct in evolution, and is now evolved into the apex predator. Randy's entire body is a weapon. He's forged him through two decades of rule. Now, Randy Ward is no ordinary man, and, and there's nothing he won't do to take you down. His opponent must understand the presence and the danger in front of him. Well, this gentleman wanted to step foot on the island of relevancy. Well, here he is. I promise it's going to take everything he has if he wants to make it off the island. Tribal Chief has participated in some of the biggest matches we have ever seen. Including an absolutely unforgettable SummerSlam main event. The first last man standing match in SummerSlam history. Just one of countless memorable moments in the incredible career of Roman Reigns. And the scary part is Saxton, the Tribal Chief is nowhere near finished. to take on the Apex Predator, the Viper. One of the greatest of all time. This is going to be a rough night for him. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the WWE Universal Introducing the challenger from St. Louis, Missouri, weighing in at 250 pounds, the Viper, Randy Orton! And his opponent, from Pensacola, Florida, weighing in at 265 pounds, he is the WWE Universal Champion, Roman Reigns! This is always a match with enormous implications for the landscape of the entire WWE. This capacity crowd is waiting with bated breath. The Universal Championship, it doesn't get bigger than this. Being the Universal Champion always carries a lot of distractions, a lot of responsibilities to worry about. The champ needs not worry about anything else than what's in front of him. He knows what a capable, dangerous competitor his challenger is. No doubt if the champ is off his game, they may be removing the nameplates off the Universal title. for the defending champion. Those one counts getting harder and harder to kick out of. He's heading back to the ring. Stick kick. 
Placing them right where they want them, into the corner. Gotta hurt. Pulverizing the arm is a great way to create an advantage. Basically forcing your opponent to fight one-handed. Textbook jumping clothesline. Oof. An attack on the knee. Repositioning their opponent. Looks like a neck breaker. Oh, covered by the champ. Just kicks out. This could be a tipping point in this match. A well-timed dodge. Rapid fire right hands. Oof. For the title. Four, two. Not time to expect victory yet. Uh oh, he had it scouted. You're a Nagi, man. Oh man. Heads out of the ring, but needs to be mindful of the referee's count here. Soaring European uppercut. Uh-oh. Reigns had that scouted. Some separation with power. Driven down. Into the ring again. He's driven crossing. Oh, that was just malicious. Insulting. A bad place to be for the challenger. Reigns just sent a message with that kind of attack. From the top. He moves just in time. Oh, Randy Orton looking for Old Faithful. Vengeance, Randy Orton! Oh, no, not this. Orton's doing many a point. Sends him into the corner. Close line in the corner. Uh oh. Counters the Viper's attack. Final the counter. Reigns able to sidestep. Side headlock applied. champ had it in the bag. This is how much the championship needs. You can see the sweat drip out of the challengers every pour. I don't believe it. Reigns has ended so many matches that way, but this one just took an unexpected turn. And that definitely made solid impact. Whoa, powering with a chop block will halter any attack. Hooked up. DDT! That'll mess up the back of your neck. There's a reason this man is called the Apex Predator. Tides are beginning to shift in the favor of the Viper. Gets him with the counter. Almost 
inhuman at this point. Oh, kick right into the gut. Another, and another one. one. Oh, and a close line to follow. Hooked up and DDT. Boom. This is where desperation becomes a factor. Time to pull out all the stops. Oh, sleep with the guillotine. Submission locked in tight. Nowhere to go. No escape. This could be the end. There's no way he survives this. No way. The guillotine locked in. This is The mark and more hits up there can leave you dazed. Oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. Orton now dictating the pace here. Roman's being picked apart. Ooh, decision knee drop. Randy Orton on the apron has him where he wants him. Look at that gash on the face of Reigns. out of the ring. What's next? Whoa. Big counter from Reigns. Finally, Roman's able to interrupt these attacks for a moment. Yeah, Roman was able to momentarily stop the bleeding, but can he take control of this match? Oh, it is aggression, just pure brutality. Come on, easy. A beatdown on the big dog. And Orton's turned the match in his favor. Sit straight into the barricade. It's just right for him. Nice. That only will wake you up or knock you out. Tag with a punch. Oh, it gets put into the barricade. Referee's count only getting higher. Come on. Got to get back in the ring. Answer that with a knee to the gut. Catches him. Punch. He leaves the ring, but he could lose this match by count out. Toss back into the ring. For the win to retain the championship! Yeah, no, he doesn't get the three. What a match. And not, oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. He's stuck with his opponent from the top turnbuckle. Watch out. Here is your winner, and still, WWE Universal Champion, Roman Reigns! You cannot say they didn't give it their all and then some to achieve this victory. The Apex Predator fell prey to a better opponent tonight. I can't believe it happened.